is Lance here at Trans West Truck Trailer RV located in Belton, Missouri. Today I'd like to bring you this beautiful 2016, it's an Allegro Bus 45OP. Absolutely gorgeous. I think everybody out there knows the different brand and what makes it special. Uh, that is really one of my favorites. This Nature 4 plant is one of my favorites. Uh, to start it off here, they do have uh, this nice little feature where the generator will actually slide out of the front cap. It is a 10,000. your seat stops to working or your power window you just come here and push the breaker and it resets it for you you do have a air port here for uh, air compressor coming down here just a little extra storage bay i do love how tip and doors they shut just effortlessly it just takes no effort whatsoever uh, right next to it we got a nice little bank of batteries you got six six volt batteries in there you got your house disconnect there just to the right um you do have your uh, hydraulic uh cables there really easy to get to if your technician needs to work on your leveling system you got your nice slide train there they are going to be manual and they do go either direction so pretty convenient now every van does have its own little light it does light up there are led and they are motion sensors, so as you're walking around the coach, they'll actually turn on automatically. And I just love the nice pass-through storage, plenty of storage in this coach. And uh, we do have a nice little wet bay here. I do like the fact that we have the silk dispenser, we got a paper towel holder here. We've got easy access to your fresh water filter. You got your fresh water power, uh, fresh water hose. And I like the little knockout that they put in there. I don't have to sit there and snake the hose through the through the hole there. Pretty convenient. Coming down the way here, we got our 50 foot, 50 amp cord here, and it does have the surge protection in there. This is going to be a tag axle. Got your nice little docking light here. And I love what they've done with their slide outs too. This is going to be a single slide out. It does look like they did the work with the window package. But we'll go ahead and take a look at this on the other side of the coach. Where we got a little bit of sunshine. Your depth fuel up is on the right side of the coach. So driver's side, I love the fact that they've actually stored it up and put it on the correct side of the coach now. This coach is going to be equipped with the 450 Cummins. This will be an ISL motor. 8.9 meter. It's beautiful. Beautiful design, beautiful rear cap. You've got a couple uh, disconnects. You've got uh, about three disconnects in there that's going to help uh, turn power off to the chassis. And then coming down the corner here, you've got to have the nice integrated awning. You've got lift there. Beautiful awning. You've got your uh, uh, central bag system here. So if you want to change out your bags, you're pretty easy to do. You do have your Aqua Hot, which is the 450D model. So pretty big hydronic heating system. Coming down the way, just the other other side of the slide trays that we have. Now we do have the nice big LG TV, which is, uh, I do like the fact that it's uh, integrated into the sidewall and it does have the nice little LG sound bar just above it. And any, for anybody out there who has ever tailgated, just a nice little caddy here. You can have condiments stored in there. Typically, this is going to be where your patio space is going to be. So, patio side, just a nice little extra place to have uh, some items. You got a 110 outlet, great way to charge up phones. All right, guys, what well, does it for the outside? Absolutely beautiful coach. If you have any questions, give me a holler. We can always do a FaceTime video as we walk around the coach. And then, uh, before we uh, take a step inside, I just want to point out that it does have the keyless entry. So, really nice if you don't have your keys on you. Punching your code, and you're off and running. All right, let's take a look at what we got. All right, guys. Well, welcome to the inside of this absolutely beautiful coach. I thought I'd switch it up today, and let's start from the back. So, one of the things that makes the Allegro bus, especially the 45 OP, really unique is going to be this rear bathroom. Absolutely love it. It has the really nice double vanity sinks here. 
You've got uh, the dual medicine cabinets. You do have a power outlet on both sides of the, of the vanity. Um, just absolutely, I love the hardware that they got on these things. Just really nice deep drawer, soft closing. And then this really, really big and beautiful shower. I love the stone inlay that they got here. Just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, you got your teak seat if you just want to sit there and soak. Just a really nice job. And then coming into here is their walk-in closet. Absolutely love this feature. You've got your stack washer dryer, right? You wash your clothes. It goes from the dryer right to the hanger. You're already conveniently located. And you've got all this extra storage over here. Got the built-in cabinet with the drawers. Just a really nice, all soft closing. Just really nice space. And great, great space down here for your shoes. Got your uh, built-in safe. Just gorgeous. All right. Well, let's head into the bedroom. So the bedroom, one of the things that I really can appreciate what Tiffin does here is with their cabinetry, everything is so custom, right? All these doors they make, this is all real hardwoods. Just absolutely gorgeous. I love this this metal that they fabricated and they integrated into it. So just really nice touches to the design and the features. Even their balances here, right? They kind of fall through with that same theme. Just absolutely gorgeous. This is gonna be a king bed. And just from across from it, you're gonna see you got your LG TV with a sound bar over here and a nice little cabinet here where you'd have like your DVD player. And anytime you got electronics, it's nice to have this louvered like this so you can allow it to breathe. All right. Coming into the kitchen area, we're going to have a Maytag refrigerator here to the, to the right. Now outside we have the water purification filter. And one thing I like about residential refrigerators is you get an additional filter. So you know that the water coming out of here is nice and clean. This is going to have the uh, central back system. So you got a place for your hose, but you also have a place for the toe kick so you can throw away the dustpan. Now this is gonna be a bath and a half. As you can see, just absolutely gorgeous. I love this backsplash that they got going on here. This is a really nice touch. And you've got your little waterfall faucet right there, just pretty neat. And for all you chefs out there, check out this kitchen. Just just absolutely beautiful. You've got the multi-tiered uh, countertop space. You've got these other little extra drawers. You know, when you actually get parked, this is kind of nice to be able to put maybe some spices up there. And uh, the built-in sink here is uh, the same as with the countertop. So you got your Corian sink and uh, it's all undermounted. Just absolutely huge, a lot of space in there. And then the dishwasher itself is it's made to look like the rest of the cabinets. Great storage. For those who don't like dishwashers, you know, you can store your pots and pans in there. And true to the Tiffin fashion, these guys are all about their custom uh, woodwork. As you can see, you got a place for a trash can there. Just pretty neat. And then more built-ins. I just love what they do with that. All hidden hinges. You're not seeing any of the hardware on the outside of the cabinet. You got your induction cooktop and just loads of counter space, right? I love how they wrap all this around. I'll close this up real quick. All right. So pretty nice and um, just across from the kitchen, you're gonna see that they have this really nice uh, table set up. This will extend out, so quite large for those people who want to maybe telecommute. They actually uh, set this up to be like a computer workstation. So from here, they do have a little place where you can put like a keyboard. And then just down below, they do have a space for you to like a printer or maybe like your desktop. So you can place all that there. So just a really nice place to, to work or, you know, maybe you got a kid and they need a homeschool. All right, so you got a power outlet there. And you've got additional power here that pops up out of the counter. So you're definitely not hurting for, for power. All right, pretty fun living room. I do love what they've done here. You've got this nice, beautiful J couch. You got, with this extended uh, little countertop, 
great place to maybe set drinks. You do have another cup holder just on the back side of the couch. And um, all the blinds in this coach are going to be power. We'll take a look over here and see. We'll give you a little idea how those work. So we'll stop it and we're going to bring down our, our nightshades. Let's see here. So it does have both the day. We'll stop it there. So it has both the day and the night. Nice little recliner chair while you're sitting here. Kick it back, maybe reading a nice book with the fireplace going, right? You got your LG TV, life is good. Beautiful J couch. Just a nice place for everybody to kind of sit. And uh, it really feels very cozy, very, very homey in here. All right. Well, coming up into the, the cockpit area, one of the things that I really love about the, the uh, Tip and Allegro bus is how they put all the smart controls here on the steering wheel. Right, you got all these little paddle controls to control volume. To, um, uh, they also have the telescoping uh, tilt wheel, so that'll come down or it'll uh, telescope in and out too. Now, you do have a power window, it does have the uh, high and low engine brake, not exhaust brake. That's something that you would typically get when you move into a higher end coach. It does come with navigation. And uh, this step cover does close off. And both of these seats will turn around and actually incorporate into the living space. And just makes a really nice uh, environment. Guys, one of my favorite floor plans, 2016 Allegra Bus 45 OP. If you have any questions, or if you'd like me to maybe send you the MSRP on this, so you can see how this thing was equipped when it came, when it was built from the factory, give me a call. My number is 208-290. 5750. I look forward to hearing from you.